In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to effectively loop your Cinemagraph for seamless motion using Cinemagraph Pro for Mac. For the example, I'll be using a train. First, trim your video. Line up your first and last frame to ensure a smooth loop. Next, you can choose whether you want to repeat or bounce the movement. You can adjust your speed and delay during this step as well. The speed you can increase, decrease, and delay adds an element of surprise. The last crucial step is the crossfade. Crossfading blends the first and last frames together. You may not always need a crossfade if your frames line up perfectly. An important tip here is that the longer the crossfade, the longer the blend. We hope that this video helped you in some way. If you have any more questions on how to effectively loop your cinemagraph, please let us know.